Crafters, explorers, and adventurers. I am the Killer Gamer, and we are back here with the my uh, the Microsoft. Uh, <laughs> I guess it is because it's uh, Microsoft did own it. Uh, but uh, the uh, Minecraft Survival Showcase, featuring Greenfield, the largest city that I'm aware of that has been built. I'm sure there are other ones, but. This one's original, and it has a lot of people that have been working on it. They've been working on it for years. This thing is really huge. Uh, we're not playing the latest version. We're playing the same version uh, that we did when we first started. But once we get through everything, then we'll take a look at whatever the latest version that's out. And uh, we can do some comparisons or something. All right. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and talk about what we're doing on this episode. All right, so we got the map right here. We're in Sea Haven. We just recently uh, finished this yellow area here. Do you see how I got all the episodes written? I didn't even mention that in the last episode. But I have them all planned out. I know how long this is going to take. So we're up here in this red area for episode 118. So we're checking out this side and this side right here. Here we go. Now, if you're hearing something in the background, they are little air conditioner fans. Um, more like EVAP coolers, if anything. But they kind of work like air conditioners. If you put cold water in there. Oh, there's the spider. I forgot about that. Uh, ice inside the thing. And then if you like soak the filters and freeze them, you can get cold air coming out doesn't last very long, but uh, you can't do that. Pest control! Alright, so we're crossing the freeway. Going over it. Hey, look at all the colors over there on that uh, off-ramp. Okay, so let's get started going this way. We got the Monster Rave Apparel Studio. Big old TV up there. an interesting idea. I like that. Alright, we got an elevator. And... see this on the other side. Let's see what we got upstairs. Ouch. Looks like 
like we've got some off office uh, areas. Get creative. Meeting room number two, also snacks. Where? <laughs> I don't see snacks. <laughs> I see a TV. The TV advertises snacks. That's what it does. That's what it is. Meeting room plus snacks. Must be the TV. Alright, so now we got some... areas. That's the other road, and the other side we'll be looking at. Oh, ho, ho! And I was thinking earlier uh, that I was going to put my sword and shield away just so they weren't in the way when looking at stuff. Um, I guess it's a good thing I didn't do that. Monthly design contest. Vote for your favorite designs below. You can see that it's not American because there's a U in favorites. And I would say the correct spelling of favorite is with the U. And why do I say that? Is because America are descendants from England, right? So, I say that the uh, English version, not the American version, is the correct version. That's my feeling. Now, how do I spell it? I-T. No. <laughs> I, I do spell it the American way. Um, just because, you know, that's where I'm at and that's what people expect to see. But if I was in England right now, I would spell it the English way. This looks like the same, almost the same kind of floor. Oh, this is interesting. So this is not a pool table, but... Design and management. Design room. 
the boss guy, one blubber boy. <laughs> one blubber boy won. Mr. Boss. sure where they are. Probably in one of these rooms. So that's 1A, 2A. Could be upstairs. Okay, there's nothing. going to do with all this experience? Talk about being claustrophobic. Hey, at least these doors aren't messed up. That's weird. Okay. Well, we might as well get some sleep, you know. Here. We haven't been doing this here for a while. Let's see what the room. 
roof looks like. gold up here. <laughs> yeah, we haven't been uh, looking at anything uh, on the ceiling roof for a bit. I do. We're back. How did we get back here? Oh, okay. I'm on the wrong side. I know where I'm at. <laughs> the freeway, see. Okay, another question is, what is this? There's a creeper. right there. <laughs> I saw the uh, potion thing go up. Oh no, maybe not. Where are you? Dogger land. Lanch? That would be going. Look at that over on the other side there. The uh, I'm looking at the uh, colors. It's kind of interesting. The Grand Nijipi. <laughs> I'm not sure what that what that is exactly. Napier Apartments. <laughs> Wherever he's at, he's close.
probably on the roof. I was going to say is um, what I like about Greenfield <laughs> is that it makes use of, you know, vanilla Mi Minecraft without any mods or anything, just to kind of give you some creative ideas of, now, of what you can do. Now, keep in mind, these are actual Greenfield textures here, so if you didn't have the texture pack, it wouldn't look right. It would look wrong. <clears throat> I think these are generally the same. something at the back of your throat and you just can't get it out. <coughs> okay, it looks like the entryway is in over here. Basically, we got some apartments. <clears throat> oh! I, I knew there were stairs here, but I didn't know where the up way was. was so, here it is. Wow. Talk about a really small apartment. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> it's got a big bedroom, though. <laughs> This is dark. I'm surprised there's not something inside. Uh, 
<clears throat> yeah, I thought the sun was going down. <clears throat> <clears throat> They're generally all the same, so we don't need to look at all of them. <clears throat> okay, and there's the alley. <clears throat> so now we got the back buildings here with... Oh, I love this. these colors here. Yes, the Flamingo Inn. Yeah, the pink makes sense. <clears throat> With pink glass. $245. <clears throat> the Flamingo Bar and Grill. Got a way up here. Let's take a look at these rooms. This one doesn't have... Oh, my. They're not much rooms, are they? All you get is a room with a bed and a little shower. Well, you know, I guess technically um, it's kind of like a... Well, this is more like a hotel. I was going to say a motel. But the, diff the difference between a hotel and a motel is hotel... The motels, the doors are on the outside. Whereas, you know, they, they're you come in from the outside the hotel the doors are inside where there's a hallway does that make sense that's what i that's what i have been told and it makes sense <clears throat> i don't know where the term motel comes from i know the motels is a great group from the 80s <laughs> Always ask Chat GPT. We can make it into a documentary or something like that. I know there's been some complaints in regards to the AI documentaries that I've been putting on the channel. You know, some that have never <clears throat> the uh, the ones that are here. You know, that that been here on Killer TV. They get it. They they know what they know what I'm going for because I, I get a little silly on it, but um, the whole idea behind it's like why I like messing with it. Oh, my, this is dark. Is because I can do a documentary about anything, like motels, for example. I can say, hey, make a documentary about the difference between hotels and motels. I can tell it to make it funny, make it sarcastic. And that's what I like. You know, I don't have to sit there and go and try to find a documentary. I can make one of my own. And I, you know, I do a lot of stuff for the channel. So it's not like I can sit there. It's not like I've got time to to do that and do everything else so it's just a nifty little tool that I can do uh, use you know to put something together something that would be a little bit of fun and you know they're not supposed to be serious documentaries or anything I mean, you know sometimes you know they're not really joke you know I don't do like humor with them but uh, they're just, you know, they're light-hearted. You know, they're not supposed to be Academy Award-winning, you know, documentaries or something. I mean, come on, this is YouTube. <laughs> this is YouTube. What are you expecting? 
Factory Hip Hop Club. Let's hippity hoppity our way in here. And yeah, you know, as far as the AI documentaries, sometimes, sometimes they are kind of lame <laughs> because uh, it thinks it's funny and it's not. But I tell you, and I've and I've and I've made some documentaries that have been. When it gets it, when the AI gets it, it nails it. It's pretty good. How do you get down to the dance floor? Did I miss it? Is it down here? Oh, okay, I was already down here. Got it. There's an upstairs, though. He had armor and everything. Staircase right there. Now, some of you may or may not know that I have a Yep, you come through the back. I wondered about that. You may or may not know that I have a reaction series. And I use AI to put together the videos uh, that I'm going to do a reaction on. Oh, pff, yeah, there it is right there, apartment entrance around the back. Because, you know, there's a lot of channels that do reaction videos, and, you know, it's like they're... One channel does a reaction of one video, and then another one does... You know, the same type of video. They use the same type of video to make a reaction. And I didn't want to be that guy, you know, that uh, just takes the same video that they're doing and doing a reaction. So, I thought, what if I were to create, oh, hey, how are you?
another one. <laughs> I can't. I, I pulled that off twice. Holy crap! There you are. I got a piece of iron. <laughs> I have not killed a zombie and gotten a piece of iron in like forever. Okay, so what I was saying is I just make my I make my own videos. I come up with topics. Um Some of them, you know, are just interesting little topics that I just kind of think of and put a documentary you know turn it into a documentary I let AI do it so so I don't know what it's doing uh, and sometimes I'll make them sarcastic and then I let it render I do something like you know maybe like a 10 10 minute video because I'm gonna be doing reaction a reaction to it and stopping it and making comments and stuff And then I don't watch it, uh, you know, right away. I wait to watch it when I'm ready to record. So that way you can see an honest reaction, right? Some people like it. Not a whole lot, but you know, some do. And I've got a whole bunch of ideas that I wrote down. It's just meant to be fun, you know? It's not meant to be serious. Just kind of laid back, kick back, have a little bit of fun. You know, that's all there is. Ken's flowers. Well, Ken, I can't open the door. Then I've got these uh, computer gaming uh, videos, and they're all supposed to be silly and sarcastic, right? Like I've had one where, you know, the floppy drive is better than the CD drive, and um, throw away your keyboard, you don't need it, or throw, throw away your mouse, you don't need it, that there. Uh, things about keyboards and the any key and uh, and there are some people out there that take it seriously no 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 you, you don't do your research and blah 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 this blah 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 I'm like what part of comedy did you not understand because it, it's in the description section it says comedy it's like come on they take it all seriously and stuff then there's other, this is totally AI. I'm like, not really? <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> yes, it's AI, nitwit. Why don't you watch other stuff on my channel that's not AI? This is not AI. Well, one day it might be. Uh, for not right now, it's not AI.
but like I was saying before, you know, the the viewers that have been here on the channel for a while, they get it. They understand. They they you know, they've been here for a while. They've seen the videos that I made and they know that hey, we just have fun here. And it's not for everyone. I mean, you know, there are people that just want to see Minecraft or, you know, they just want to see Flight Simulator. There are some that they'll watch whatever I put out because they enjoy uh, my style. You know, that's all That's all cool. I'm happy with about that. You know, so these other things that I do that are not gaming, you know, they might be like, well, you know, I'm not really interested in that. And then some others would be like, yeah, you know what? I'm kind of looking for something a little different, a little fresh. See, there you go. All right, we're crossing the street. Second half. See, and that's why that's why we call it Killer TV. So that way, um, this doesn't have a window. <laughs> Maybe it does. No, it does not. Hmm. Because it's it's a television station. I mean, you know, some some people would you know tune the TV on on one channel and keep it there all day. Others, you know, they have their channel and they'll they'll turn it on on certain times, certain days. That is awfully loud. You know, they'll turn it on on certain days. Watch certain shows during the week or during a certain time and there you go there's got to be something in here Hiding right here. Wow. It's got light now. <laughs> I wasn't even going to try to do that one. another floor <laughs> uh, I don't even know I forgot where the stairs were at up here I had my shield up what the
that I've gone back to live streaming again. Because I can now have a regular schedule. And I was trying to figure out how I was going to do that. And then, you know, sometimes I just get revelations that come to me. And then I act upon it. And I, you know, refine it a little bit. So, like, I started off with certain uh, times to begin with. And then realized, oh, you know, I need to change this a little bit. from there and I just wasn't so sure about Twitch uh, as far as going back there I don't know just too much stuff going on with Twitch that I don't want to deal with thinking of doing kind of like a, a farewell stream, maybe make it three parts. Just so I can close that chapter and put it behind me. I mean, I don't know. I mean... I've got YouTube I can st stream on, so why do I need Twitch? I don't know. What do you all think? I've got more people watching my streams here than they did on, on uh, Twitch. Sometimes, though, there were times where there would be a raid on someone's channel and you get all these uh, viewers. And that was cool. Okay. Well, I think I know what's out there, so. <laughs> Let's just go back this way. Laundry. Laundry. <laughs> stick to my plan. I don't want to break the videos up or you know, this is what, 118? And we're going to stick to it. This will be one episode. A phone booth. <laughs> I think that's what that is. There's a fire over there. I didn't cause that, did I? You see the beds that I left. Did I leave one over? Look at this. I left one there and I left one. What? I couldn't just pick. Oh, jeez. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Mr. The Tree Killer built this.
under 21. I heard a baby zombie up here somewhere, so they're not paying attention. That's bad parenting. They're not uh, watching their kid. I wonder if Mr. The Tree Killer well okay that's the guy's okay that's the guy that, uh, name that did this I was beginning to think that maybe it was a theater what is a theater like that was the name of the movie or something I like how they got this corner thing sitting here because you've seen corners of uh, theaters that look like that That over there is the next episode. Tree Cafe. So with all the live streaming, I haven't been able to spend as much time on videos uh, as I used to. But I think a lot of our viewers would prefer to see me live stream. I have live streamed Greenfield before and they, they didn't really, viewers didn't really like it. They, they prefer it to be more quieter and relaxed, kind of like ASMR. And yeah, doing the live stream with it just, it kind of took away from the from the whole thing but um, so what I'm planning on doing and we'll know if, if you're uh, watching the whole episodes or not because uh, if you're only skipping around and stuff you, you miss all the good stuff but because uh, <laughs> I'll talk a lot about behind the scenes and things that I'm looking at thinking about But I'm going to be working on the 2025 content early, like six months early. My goal is to try to get all the content, all the series and episodes and stuff that I've been, you know, that I want to get out. Have it all recorded, have it all edited, have it all scheduled. That way it's good. It's all done. If there if I ever have a problem with my computer or I'm in a situation where I can't do videos, it's okay. Because all of it's done. And the videos will be here for everyone to watch. 
in the meantime, I can focus on, you know, other types of content. I can focus on the live streams. I might be able to do more live streams. Or I can start focusing on, you know, more higher quality content. That's going to take a little bit. I am totally lost. <laughs> Which way? Here we go. There are some things that I don't record out too far in advance, like a truck simulator for one, because of the uh, downloadable content, because of the states and stuff that they release. And I want to be able to get in on the action and, you know, not be like a year behind or something. <laughs> but a lot of things I can record in advance. Greenfield's going to be one of them. One thing that I would like to do is get this completely recorded. I mean, all the way through. I have it all mapped out. So I do have an end game uh, with Greenfield. It should take somewhere around 100, almost 150 episodes. And it should be done. I needed to plan ahead so that way I knew what I, you know, I, I had a game plan on what I was doing and and I got it all mapped out. But because I did that, now I have a visual. I can see the goal. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Um, I know where we're going to be and when we're going to be there. get this series completed. The front of the building. PlayStation 3, Xbox. Hiding in here? Jeez. This one at least has light. Well, at least we know what's over on the other side. Just some empty rooms. For the most part. Almost done. Like the last one here. G, welcome to Green Sense Residence. Your total is fifteen dollars and twenty-four cents. Wow, well, I wish rooms would cost that much. <laughs> Elevator. 
elevator shaft. A doorway. <laughs> uh, don't go out that door. I think we came in this way. shot out from the darkness. See if that staircase of the roof is up here. Because we saw it. Yep. Maybe there's something up here. Let's take a look. folks we have accomplished our goal of what we're exploring so I want to thank you for hanging out with me and hope you'll check out the other series on the channel all the Minecraft series and everything else that I do we'll see you next time have a killer awesome day